In year two, we have been learning about money. Which of these coins is worth the least? And which of these coins is worth the most money? You should have said one P is worth the least and two pounds is worth the most. Two pounds is 200 pence. One pound is 100 pence. Have a go at counting how much money there is on screen. For the first question, we've got six 1Ps, so you should have six pence. For the second question, you've got four 2Ps, so you're counting in twos. Two, four, six, eight. Eight pence. Then we are counting in fives. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 30 pence altogether. Next we have 4 10 p's, so we're counting in 10s, 10, 20, 30, 40, you have got 40 pence. And 3 20 p's, 20, 40, 60, so that will be 60 pence. For this question, you need to use the greater than, less than and equal to symbols to compare these coins. Work out how much you've got on each side and then decide which symbol goes in between. For the first one, we've got four 1Ps, so that's 4P. And on the other side, we've got three 2Ps, 2, 4, 6, 6P. So the correct symbol is less than. 4p is less than 6p. Then we've got 3 5p, so that will be 5, 10, 15, 15p. And on the other side, we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 8 1p's, which is 8p. You should have 15p is greater than 8p. And for the bottom question, we've got 10, 20, 30, 40. 4 10 p's is 40p, and 20, 40. 2 20 p's is 40p. Because these amounts are the same, the missing symbol will be equals. Pause the video here and have a go at counting the money where the coins are different. You should have 47 pence, 40 pence, and 64 pence. As well as coins, we have also got notes. The £5 note is worth five £1 coins. The £10 note is worth ten £1 coins. And the £20 note is worth £21 coins. Pause the video and have a go at working out how much money each of these children have got. Matt has got two £5 notes. 5 add 5 equals 10, so he has got £10. Lola has got 10, add five pounds, add a two pound coin. So she has got 17 pounds altogether. Charlie has got 50p, add 20p, which is 70p. Add 2p, add 2p, which is 4p. So altogether, he has got 74 pence. And Luke has got 20 pounds, add 10 pounds, add 10 pounds, which is 40 pounds. Who has got the most amount of money and who has got the least? For our reasoning question, it says four five pence coins are worth more than two ten pence coins. Do you agree? Explain why.
four five pence coins, if we count in fives, five, 10, 15, 20. So that's 20 pence. And two 10 pence coins, if we count in tens, 10, 20. So the answer is, I do not agree because they are worth the same. Four five pence coins are worth 20 pence and two 10 pence coins are worth 20 pence as well. And for the problem solving question, it says, Sid says, I have bought two items for my holiday. One item costs nine pounds more than the other. What might Sid have bought? Pause the video here and have a go at working out which two items he could have bought for his holiday. Remember, they have to have a difference of nine pounds. So Sid could have bought the sandals and the sunglasses because the sandals cost £12 and the sunglasses cost £3. 12 subtract 3 equals 9. So they have got a difference of £9. He could have also bought the suitcase and the towel because the suitcase is £18 and the towel is £9. 18 subtract 9 equals 9. 